welcome to my youtube channel today i shall discuss the tropics elongation due to self weight of the body in stress 10 chapter for engineering students and the students of class 11 science also please like and share my video and subscribe my channel today i shall discuss the chapter stress 10 and the topics elongation due to self weight We know the modulus of elasticity E is equal to stress by strain. This stress is denoted by sigma and this strain is denoted by epsilon. Now stress is equal to force per area and strain delta L by L the deformation by original length. So, this is equal to PL divided by delta L into A or delta L is equal to PL by AE. So, in direct load, in direct load W, the elongation delta L is equal to WL by A E as P is equal to W. Today I shall discuss the elongation of the cell point. So we see that in direct load the elongation delta L is equal to WL by A E. Now we discuss the elongation due to self weight of the body. I consider a bar hanging from a fixed end hanging freely whose length is equal to L and the cross sectional area A and uh, the Young's modulus E. Let us take a small strip. Let us take a small strip dx from the B point from B at a distance x. Let us take a small strip dx at a distance x uh, from b. If rho is the density or specific weight of the section, of the bar then the weight of the section of the length x is equal to rho into volume. We know that rho is equal to mass by volume. Then the mass, the weight, the weight by volume, the weight is equal to rho into v. So volume here volume is equal to rho into a into x. This load is the fully responsible for the elongation for this small strip. 
So the elongation of the small strip, elongation of the small strip dx is equal to PL by A here P is equal to the total weight of this section that is rho A x and L summon dx divided by A into E. A and A cancel rho x dx by E. So the total elongation total elongation delta L is equal to integration 0 to L. If we integrate from 0 to L then we get the total elongation of the self due to the self weight of the body that is rho x dx by E. that is is equal to rho by e in outer and x dx 0 to L. And that is is equal to rho by e. If we integrate this then we get x square by 2 and lower limit 0 upper limit L. Rho by e 2e is come in outer then that is the L square minus 0 square so rho into L square by 2e. If we multiply the numerator by a and the denominator also a then we get this here rho a and L it is the weight total weight of the body and L divided by 2 A E. So, rho A L that is equal to W total weight of the body into L divided by twice A E. So, the conclusion in direct load in direct load delta L is equal to W L by A E and elongation due to self weight that is is equal to half into W L divided by A E in direct load elongation delta L is equal to e. So, uh, the elongation due to self weight of the same load W, we get the half of the elongation in direct load. Thank you. I will come back again with another topic.